Hello guys, welcome to my channel. This is the 50th tutorial in this course and in this tutorial we are going to talk about C-scope and also we're going to understand the difference between global scope and local scope for variables. Now as you can see using code blocks I have saved a file and I have given it the name local and global variables.c and there are a few underscore characters between the words and uh, on line 1 in this file I have my stdio.h header file on line 2 I've declared a variable called a it is uh, an integer and I've given it the value 20 on line 3 I have declared the main function and then there are two statements within the body of main now before we talk about this program and why I have declared the same variable twice in the program let's first try to understand what scope is now scope in C or for that matter any programming language is the region where a variable is known and scope can be local or global and we will understand using uh, this program right here. So when this printf statement on line 6, when this statement gets executed, this statement by the way is going to print the value of A on screen. So when this statement would get executed, what value do you think would be printed on screen? Would it be 10 or would it be 20? Right? Because on both occasions, on line 2 as well as on line 5, the name of the variable is A and uh, on both lines the variable is of integer type and the format specifier that I have used within the printf statement is person D. So the integer value for the variable A will be printed but what value would be printed? Would it be 10 or would it be 20? So if you guys are thinking that the value that will be printed would be 10 then you are absolutely correct. And the reason for that is that printf is going to look for the variable A within the main function first. Right, and the scope of this variable, the one that you see on line 5, is local for the main function. And what I mean by that is that within the main function, the variable a is going to have the value 10, but outside the main function, it's going to have the value 20. So, since this variable on line 2 happens to be outside the main function or any function that's there in the program, there is just one function at the moment, but even if you have 5, 10 or 500 functions in the program, this variable a, the one on line 2 is going to be known within all the functions, right? And it's going to have the value 20 in all the functions. But if there is another variable that's a and that happens to be within some function, then any line of code that's in that function and any line of code that uses the variable is going to use the value that's local to that function right so let me run the program for you guys first and then we'll talk about it a little more so you can see that in the output window i get the message the value of a is 10. now if i would remove this statement from my program and if i would just have the printf statement in the main function then the program is going to display the value 20. Right, so I hope you guys have understood um, the difference between local scope and global scope. So that's it for this tutorial. I'm going to see you guys in the next one in which we are going to discuss something interesting again for sure. And uh, thank you so much for watching this tutorial. And please subscribe to my channel in case you haven't already. And uh, in case you have any doubts about what we discussed in this tutorial, then uh, you can shoot your comments and I'm going to try to reply to as many of them as possible. And I also have a Facebook page so you can send me messages there if you find that more convenient and uh, I'll uh, try to reply to as many messages as I can, right? So thank you so much and uh, I'll see you soon.